Samajwadi Party Chief Akhilesh Yadav today said surveys favoring the BJP in Uttar Pradesh were opium polls and not opinion polls. The Samajwadi Party leader pressed for a ban on the opinion polls shown on some TV channels in the run up to the UP polls next month. These are not opinion polls, these are opium polls. I wonder what is the basis on which these polls are done. They are trying to mislead people, Akhilesh Yadav told NDTV in an interview. These people don't ask the BJP about inflation or unemployment. Their candidates are being chased out of their constituencies because of public anger. Their government events are poorly attended. They showed a Bengal flyover in Uttar Pradesh. So what are they showing in opinion polls? Mr Yadav asked. Moving on to the next news, Punjab's former chief minister Amrinder Singh's seat sharing announcement with the BJP today was accompanied by a shocker one about his arch rival Navjot Sidhu and his old cricketing buddy Pakistan Prime Minister Imran Khan. Soon after dropping Mr Sidhu from his cabinet, he had received a call from a mutual acquaintance from Pakistan, Mr Singh told reporters today. The Pakistan Prime Minister had sent a request saying if you can take back Sidhu into your cabinet, I will be grateful. He is an old friend of mine. You can remove him if he will not work, Mr Singh said. Moving on to the next news, the World Health Organization has said that the increase in COVID-19 numbers in Southeast Asia is mainly driven by India, where the cases have seen a 150% increase in the last one week. According to the WHO, India reported 15,94,160 new cases in the week that ended on January 23rd as compared to 6,38,872 cases it recorded the previous week. In the eastern Mediterranean region, the highest numbers of new cases were reported from Morocco, 31,701 new cases against 4,610 last week with a 45% increase. Lebanon, 45,231 new cases against 38,112 last week with a 19% increase. And Tunisia, 13,416 new cases against 3,948 last week with a 194% increase. Moving on to the next news. Punjab and Haryana High Court on Monday dismissed the anticipatory bail plea of Shiromani Akali the leader and former Punjab minister Bikram Singh Majithia in the drugs case registered against him in Mohali on December 20. Majithia will now be approaching the Supreme Court for interim protection from arrest in the case. Earlier in the day, the High Court bench of Justice Lisa Gill heard arguments from both sides and the order was reserved for the pronouncement at 4 pm. Though the detailed order is awaited, the pronouncement was made at 4 pm. Moving on to the next news, the Congress on Monday released a list of 30 star campaigners for the first phase of the forthcoming Uttar Pradesh Assembly election. The list included interim party chief Sonia Gandhi, former Prime Minister Manmohan Singh, party MP Rahul Gandhi and All India Congress Committee General Secretary Priyanka Gandhi Vadra, among other leaders who are set to campaign for the grand old party in the high stakes election. Former JNU Students Union President Kanhaya Kumar, who joined the Congress in September last year, has also been made part of the star campaigners list for the UP elections. Congress General Secretary KC Venugopal has sent the list of the star campaigners to the Chief Electoral Officer of Uttar Pradesh. 